Really, Nick Jr. Really, Nick Jr. Ugh. And I'm starting to get sick and tired of these rip-offs. So, I'm doing a review slash rant on corn and peg. So, basically, the first episode just recently came on the Nick Jr. website. And it was just plain awful. So, it's basically about these two horses named Corn and Peg. And they tried to do good deeds. Again with the pink and blue color scheme. You've heard it before. Millie and Geo. Felicity and Miguel. Uni Kitty and Puppy Corn. Now we have Corn and Peg. Now, let's talk about Corn and Peg themselves. Corn thinks he's cool, but he's not. And he doesn't know how to tell time. Seriously. He's just a really dumb unicorn. And look at his mane. Oh my god. It looks like some kind of electric shot shot it before production. And Peg watches too much Peg Plus Cat 24-7. And her flowers on her mane look like very cheap doodles that were created by Louie the Bunny. Louie can't draw. And Peg's wings look very unrealistic. And the noses on those things, they look like devil horns. Just look at them. They look like devil horns. And this show was also a ripoff to My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic. I hope Hasbro sues Nick Jr. soon. Do you know who likes this show? Petula from Littlest Pet Shop World of Our Own. She wishes she could join the cast, but she can't. Because she is a sheep, not any some kind of horse. And do you know who hates the show? All characters from My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic. They want to destroy Corn and Peg. So basically, I highly recommend you don't watch it when it officially comes out on TV. Or else it will waste your time. Just like Paw Patrol, Blaze and the Monster Machines, Butterbean's Cafe... Little Charmers, Mike the Knight, Nella the Princess Knight, etc.